heard him talking over there this morning. So, town crier, John Todd, first of all, we let the band just move up to the corner there, and in comes the bishop, I say one of the, one of Lady Masson's Highland ponies, called in its homeland at Garran, for bringing the deer down off the hill. And then the school children with the chaplain there, who will join me in a moment, and John, and this little guy here, he's the shepherd, look. He's got his motorbike with him as well. And then you've got the golden fleece, this is the golden fleece. Then you've got the shearers, you've got the soldiers looking after them because there used to be revolutions about wool at one time. And you've got all these little fellas here representing all the other trades and parts of the wool industry. And we go forwards. You go with Mr. Todd, that's right. And you climb up on the chair. And you hold that and I'll hold the mic. Just wait until John's been. Ho, yay! Ho, yay! It is my pleasing duty as the official town crier for Massonshire to introduce to you today the Bishop Blaze and his chaplain. Pray be silent while the Bishop reads, but while the chaplain reads the declaration. God save the Queen. My friends, the day of Bishop Blaze is here. The joyous, joyfulest day in all the year wherein all tradesmen rejoice and sing from Coma to the greatest king. When first the art of combing was found, by blades through England it did sound, and therefore canonized by he amongst saints to all eternity. Here's a health unto our masters now, and then drink health unto our king. That what one invents the other support, while Indians mourn, we true Brits support. Well done, the chaplain. That was beautifully read. Thank you very, very much. That was very well.